Max Weber's theory of rationalization, deciphering the modern world. Max Weber, the eminent German sociologist, left an indelible mark on the field of sociology with his extensive body of work. One of his most significant contributions is the theory of rationalization, which provides profound insights into the transformation of society, economics, culture, and governance in the modern world. In this comprehensive video, we will delve deeply into Max Weber's theory of rationalization, its key components, implications, and its enduring relevance in today's rapidly evolving global landscape. Introduction to Max Weber's Theory of Rationalization Max Weber's sociological thought transcends academic boundaries. It serves as a valuable framework for comprehending the profound changes that have shaped the modern world. At the heart of his work lies the concept of rationalization, a term that he explored extensively in his writings. Rationalization, as conceptualized by Weber, refers to the systematic and calculated organization of society, economy, and institutions based on principles of efficiency, predictability, and control. It is the driving force behind the profound transformations witnessed in the modern era. Key components of Weber's theory of rationalization. 1. Bureaucracy is an ideal type. Weber believed that bureaucracy epitomized the essence of rationalization. He formulated the ideal type of bureaucracy as an organizational model characterized by a hierarchical structure, division of labor, well-defined rules and regulations, impersonal relations, and an unwavering emphasis on efficiency. While bureaucracy offered numerous advantages, Weber also acknowledged its potential for dehumanization and alienation. For example, modern governmental institutions and large corporations often adopt bureaucratic structures characterized by clearly defined roles, standardized procedures, and a focus on efficiency. 2. Instrumental rationality Instrumental rationality, a central concept in Weber's theory, refers to the pursuit of specific goals and objectives through efficient means. In a rationalized society, decisions are made based on calculated rationality rather than tradition or emotion. This form of rationality propels economic and administrative processes. Example, businesses employ cost-benefit analyzes to determine the most efficient and profitable course of action, reflecting the principle of instrumental rationality. 3. Substantive rationality In contrast to instrumental rationality, substantive rationality pertains to the pursuit of values and ideals. It involves making decisions guided by ethical, moral, or normative considerations rather than mere efficiency. Weber recognized Recognize that both instrumental and substantive rationality coexist in modern societies, often in tension with each other. Example, nonprofit organizations may prioritize substantive rationality by adhering to ethical values and moral principles in their decision making processes. 4. The Iron Cage of Rationalization One of Weber's most famous and enduring concepts is the Iron Cage of Rationalization. He posited that the rationalization of society could lead to a dehumanizing and restrictive environment. In such a system, individuals become trapped in bureaucratic structures and routinized roles, potentially leading to a loss of individuality and creativity. Example, the modern workplace, with its emphasis on strict protocols and standardized procedures, may sometimes contribute to the feeling of being trapped within the iron cage. Implications of Weber's Theory of Rationalization Max Weber's theory of rationalization has profound implications across various dimensions of society, culture, and governance. 1. Economic Rationalization Weber's ideas significantly influence our understanding of capitalism and economic systems. The relentless pursuit of efficiency, profit, and calculability characterizes modern economic institutions. 2. Cultural Shift Rationalization has transformed cultural practices, such as religion and art. Weber's concept of the disenchantment of the world describes how traditional religious beliefs and values have been replaced by secular, rationalized worldviews. 3. Technological Advancements The drive for efficiency and predictability fuels technological innovations and scientific progress. Rationalization plays a pivotal role in shaping technological advancements in the modern era. 4. Social and political structures Bureaucratic structures and rationalized administrative processes are integral to modern government governments, corporations, healthcare systems, education, and various organizations. These structures are designed to achieve predictability and control. 5. Individuality and Alienation Weber's concept of the iron cage underscores the potential for individuals to experience alienation and a loss of individuality within highly rationalized systems. This notion has implications for mental health and well-being. 
Enduring relevance in the modern world, Max Weber's theory of rationalization remains highly relevant in the contemporary world. 1. Globalization The principles of rationalization continue to shape globalization, as efficiency, predictability, and control are central to the global economy and trade. 2. Technology and AI Advances in technology, artificial intelligence, and automation reflect the ongoing pursuit of rationalization in various industries and sectors. 3. Bureaucracy Bureaucratic structures and rationalized administrative processes are omnipresent in government. Healthcare, education, and business influencing decision making, resource allocation, and public policy. 4. Environmental challenges. Rationalization has led to resource exploitation and environmental degradation, prompting discussions on sustainable practices and ethical considerations. 5. Cultural shifts. The rationalization of cultural practices, including the commodification of art and entertainment, continues to shape contemporary cultural landscapes. Conclusion Max Weber's theory of rationalization provides invaluable insights into the transformation of society, economy, and culture in the modern world. By exploring the concepts of instrumental and substantive rationality, bureaucracy, and the iron cage, we gain a deeper understanding of the profound changes that have occurred and continue to unfold in our globalized and technologically driven society. Weber's work challenges us to critically examine the consequences of rationalization and to consider how we can strike a balance between efficiency and values, individuality, and bureaucracy in an ever-evolving world. In doing so, we can navigate the complexities of the modern era while preserving our humanity and ethical principles.